I am Anil Kumar sharing with you solution of a question from my subscriber. The question here is, a cylindrical tank has a maximum height of 6 feet. It must hold 1400 gallons. Find the diameter of the tank. We are also given the conversion factor, that is 1 gallon is 231 cubic inches, right? So first let us write down what information is given to us. A cylindrical tank has maximum height of 6 feet. So we are given the height, let's say h equals to 6 feet. Now it must hold 1400 gallons, that is the volume, right? So volume, let's say v is equals to 1400 gallons. And then we need to find diameter of the tank. So we need to find diameter, right? Diameter D, which is twice radius. So diameter is 2 times R, right? So this is what we need to find. We are also given here that 1 gallon is 231 cubic inches. So we are given unit conversion, 1 gallon equals to 231 cubic inches, right? So let's write cubic inches. Now that suggests that we could convert this unit of gallons into cubic inches and if we do that we also need to convert height in inches right so we know one feet is equals to 12 inches so we'll use all this information to do the conversion so let's do the conversion now so height of six feet if i want to convert to inches will be six into 12 which is 72 inches, right? As far as the volume is concerned, 1400 will be multiplied by 231. So let's do that. So it is 1400 times 231, uh, and that gives us, let's do it, 1400 times 231, and that is equals to 323, 400, all right? So those many cubic inches, or you can say inch cube, is that okay? So it's those many cubic inches. So the result will be in inches. Gallons is this and one feet. So that's what is given to us. Now let's look into the diagram, what we're trying to find. So we have a cylindrical tank whose maximum height is given to us. Let's say this is the tank. Okay. And what we know here is that the height of the tank is 72 inches. We need to find the diameter, right? So we need to find the diameter. And let us say that the radius is R. Now what is the formula for volume? So we'll just write down the formula for volume. Isolate the variable which we need to find, substitute the values, and do the needful. Now, volume of a cylinder is pi r square h. We need to find radius. Twice radius will be diameter. Is that okay? So, let's isolate r from here. So, r square is equals to volume divided by pi h. And from here, we can say r is equals to square root of volume divided by pi h. Is that okay? That becomes the radius. And the diameter will be 2 times the radius. So let me write down that also. So diameter will be 2 times the radius. So that will be equals to 2 times square root of volume divided by pi h. So that becomes the formula for finding the diameter, right? Now we only need to substitute our values and calculate the answer, right? So from here, we can say diameter is equals to 2 times square root of volume, which is that big number, 3, 2, 3, 400, divided by pi, right? So let me write pi here, times h, which is 6 into 12, 72, right? So that becomes the diameter. So let's figure this out. So we have 2 times within square root 
323400 divided by within brackets pi times 72 bracket close all right and equal to so that gives us 75.62 now this answer is in inches right so this is in inches we can now convert this to feet also right so we could write diameter as 75.62 divided by 12 so that we get it in feet right so let's do it so whatever answer we have i'm dividing that by 12 and then we'll round it right so this is equals to 6.3 feet right so that is how we can actually solve the question right so the answer here is diameter d is equals to 6.3 feet i'm anil kumar and i hope the steps are absolutely clear so <clears throat> able the thing is we should look into the units which will help us get the right solution so in this particular question since the units worked out best in inches or cubic inches we converted all the in units accordingly we also derived the formula for the diameter and then substituted the values to get the answer this approach i hope works with most of the questions like this i'm anil kumar and i hope that helps thanks for sharing all the best